All right, now this is part three of our series, No Fear Here. This is a short little teaching on how to face giants. I wanted to make sure that you had a little bit of a how-to, and I want to back up on our 1 Samuel chapter 17 story of David and Goliath. Nobody can teach us how to face giants like God can through his servant David the psalmist, right? So let's learn together from David the shepherd boy how to operate in the spirit of power, love, and a sound mind, right? From 2 Corinthians 1.7. Let's learn how to operate in the spirit of power, love, and a sound mind. And let's return to the famous account of the killing of Goliath the giant in 1 Samuel chapter 17. And let me give you a few points on how to do this. How to face giants, we'll call this, from the shepherd boy's manual, right? Number one, preparation. Preparation is a biblical principle. Everyone tells the Goliath story, but nobody talks about the target practice. Everybody overlooks that mustard seed type thinking, right? Everybody likes the oak tree, but we forget about the oak seed. Everybody kind of goes, look at the power of that big redwood, but we forget it started out as a tiny seed. David, the psalmist, as a slingshot expert, he started out practicing, target practicing, probably targeted practicing on rabbits and stuff like that. He started out with his faith target practicing, building his faith, meditating on the Word of God. You don't just start one day killing giants. You grow to it. So preparation is key, number one. It's a spirit of a sound mind. That's where your preparation works in the sound mind. No fear here. 